This is Adam reporting for Get Out There Magazine. This weekend I'll be canoe camping at the Papinola Bell Wildlife Reserve. The Papinola Bell Wildlife Reserve is about a two hour drive northeast of Ottawa, a three hour drive northwest of Montreal, and is the most southerly wildlife reserve in Quebec. To access the park, you'll first have to sign in at one of the reserve's registration centers. Since we stayed in the park's northern section, we checked in at Pinef, where we paid for our park access as well as our canoe rental as we were about to embark on an epic long weekend of canoe camping. The Papinola Bell Wildlife Reserve offers lake-to-lake -lake canoe routes, whitewater canoeing down Rivière de Sourde, and campgrounds accessible only by water. Campsites are indicated by signs that are visible from the water, and the number of tents allowed on each site is indicated by the official Parks Quebec map that's handed out at the registration centre. While canoe camping, you should expect to see stunning views, wildlife, beaches, and if you're lucky, an 8 meter cliff to jump off. While we stayed on the same lake for the duration of our trip, you have the option to portage 100 to 650 meters from lake to lake as part of the 35 portage options at the Papinola Bell Wildlife Reserve. Various portage circuits are offered ranging from 14 to 44 kilometers in length, which all depart from Lac des Sept Frères. There are also 22 kilometers of easy and intermediate hiking trails, and in case you were wondering, the bushwhacking was thick and tough. You will definitely need a compass or GPS watch to get you back to your campsite. This is Adam Quitko reporting for Get Out There magazine, signing off from the Papinola Bell Wildlife Reserve. Let us know if you can think of any national parks or wildlife reserves in eastern Canada that you think we should check out, and be sure to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with the Canadian endurance sports scene.